Destroyer. Feel the power of Thor! You, Captain Kirk's father, you feel the power of Michael Bay explosion! I summon thunder and lightning! Jackpot! What up, Iron Man fans? What up, True Believers? What up, Batman fans? What up, Transformer fans? What up, DC fans? Uh -huh. What up, Thor fans? This is Sean Long and Longshot Dream Song Con bringing you Thor Lightning Power Thor Movie Toy. Here we got the packaging for the Lightning Power Thor. Avengers Assemble, always we will fight as one. Try me lights and sounds, press both. Lightning Power requires two uh, AAA batteries, so make sure that it includes it. Says Thor the Mighty Avenger by Marvel Seuss with a nice picture of Thor there. On the side of the box has a nice picture of Thor right there too. Very cool. On the back we have a really cool picture of Thor. that says flashing lights, electronic speech, interchangeable weapon, snap on lightning launcher. Has a little bio of Thor. Shows all the other Thor toys like lightning hammer, armor Asgard Thor helmet, armor Asgard a Thor sword. I am Thor, fill the might of my hammer. You're no match for the mighty Thor. But it's hammer time, time to open up Thor. So here we got the lightning power Thor. Now the sculpt is pretty good. I mean, it's not like a hot toy sculpt, but you can definitely see Chris Hemsworth in the sculpt. And the skin tone, it could use a little more paint detail, but this is more aimed for kids. But um, the hair actually has some really cool detail. It has a uh, couple of different shades of uh, blonde and some darker tones in there to get on there. The armor has some nice shine to it. Um, the arms could have had some more paint detail in between them, but like I said, it's more aimed for kids. But um, yeah, you can see here, it's nice shimmery blue and different grays and everything. The cape is a uh, hard plastic, but it has a nice little... Uh, ripple or right there you can take it off right there it has two pegs just like the uh, 334 inch figure or hammer mew and there uh, what I like about it, it has a little rope right there um, it, it's just pretty gray it has some uh, Asgardian or Viking symbols even though it's a uh, you know they're in Asgard so but um it is a semi translucent because you know it'll light up but um the pants could have had more detail more of a plain black with a little bit of um, silver, a little bit, but not that much. Um, overall, it's really cool. It's not the best uh, in detail, but it's definitely not the worst. For articulation, this figure is no Marvel Legend. His head can fully rotate. His arms uh, could uh, fully rotate more if you take off the cape. You bend at the elbow. This uh, arm has wrist articulation because of the hammer. It, has, it can't have any articulation, but the legs go forward and back and bend at the knee, but no ankle articulation. It's mostly just going to stand and have some arm, but not that, that much articulation at all. For accessories, Thor comes with two. He comes with this nice Asgardian uh, warrior sword. It has some nice gold, um, very shimmery paint on there with some brown for the handle, and even the silver here is very shimmery, so I like that. It looks very cool. Just It's it's a harder plastic. Just like the Repulsor Power Iron Man, Thor comes with a missile launcher. This is supposed to be a lightning bolt, which is a blue translucent missile, and you place it can fit on his arm if you so please. This is definitely more of a kid feature because I don't see many collectors or adults using that, but the, it does shoot out pretty powerful, not too powerful, So, and the missile is not that hard, so it, it shouldn't hurt anyone. But the real reason you bought this toy is for the lights and sound feature. This figure has a lot of different phrases, which is cool. If you have the Repulsive Power Iron Man, uh, this is definitely up your alley. You press the button right here, and he'll say a bunch of phrases, and his hammer Mjolnir will uh, light up. I turned off a few lights so you can see the, the light in the hammer. It's not as bright in... Um, Light, lighted areas, but in darker areas, you definitely see the light up. I am Thor! So you can see his hammer lights up right there. It's more on the sides you see. You're no match for the mighty Thor! For Odin! For Asgard! The voice definitely doesn't sound like Chris Hemsworth. It, if it is, awesome, but it, it, I don't, I can't really tell if that's, it's probably not. It's probably just some voice actor that's not John 3.0, and it's not, it's not John, <laughs> uh, he would have told me. Frost Giants! Ha! Feel the power of Thor! At least that's some really cool lightning sound. Troya, feel the power of Thor! Whosoever holds this hammer, if he be worthy, 
shall possess the power of Thor. Feel the rage of battle! I am Thor! Feel the might of my hammer! Frost Giants! Ha! Feel the power of Thor! Feel the rage of battle! Um. Mm. Right now, I just feel this donut in my mouth, and it's good. Do you want any donuts for you and your buddies? For Odin! For Asgard! Oh, that's a lot of donuts. Just because I'm a billionaire doesn't mean I can buy for all you Asgardians. Anything else, Thor? Feel the might of my hammer! Whoa, buddy. Just because we're on the same team doesn't mean I want to feel your hammer. Size comparison time. So here you can see Lightning Power Thor is a little bit bigger than the Masterpiece Rodimus, which, by the way, I will review. Don't worry. Um... He is definitely shorter than a Hot Toys Mark IV Iron Man, so he's about 10 inches tall. So you can see how much bigger he is than the 33 4 inch uh, Thor and the Marvel Legends Destroyer here. Lightning Power Thor won't be for everyone. Kids and people who love lights and sound gimmicks like me will definitely have fun with it because, you know, lights and sounds can be very fun. I mean, it's one of the funnest action features in the toy. Um, the detail is pretty good. Uh, the articulation's not that great at all. It's definitely not a Marvel Legend, or if you want something more detailed and articulated, wait for the Hot Toys lore, even though that'll be like 10 times, or not 10 times, but like like 5 times more than this figure. But for 20 bucks, you know, compared to a lot of 6-inch figures becoming 15 bucks or more nowadays, this is not a bad deal at all. You get you know, a really cool looking display piece for Thor that talks and has lights and sounds, you know, and you have, you know, a cool little sword and a, a missile launcher. So, like I said, for 20 bucks, it's a great deal for kids or just people who love lights and sounds. But uh, if you're a big Thor fan, I highly recommend it. Hope you guys enjoyed my review. Stay tuned for more Thor reviews as well as our toy reviews. Subscribe to my channel for like. It's Sean Long saying until next time. I'm Batman. And I'm Iron Man. Whether you're a Marvel or you're a DC. There's one thing we have in common. We have alter egos. And both of us shop at Alter Ego Comics. From Hot Toys, Sideshow Collectibles, and Replicas, and more. They take pre-orders and PayPal, and they know how to be a superhero. Okay, Batman, we'll go shop at Alter Ego Comics, then drinks are on me. Why you wanna drink me? Well, Batman, you need a donut and a cough drop. Shut up, Stark! I summon thunder and lightning! <laughs> And I summon the power for you to shut up, Thor! Now that's what I call getting hammered.